Hello and welcome to this course, Function Acceleration on FPGA Part 1 Fundamentals. Are you familiar with FPGAs and C++ language and would you like to implement computationally intensive algorithms on FPGA based embedded systems? Then welcome to this course. Are you a software or hardware student? who is going to learn the latest technologies about FPGA without spending too much to learn low-level tedious logic optimization techniques, then welcome to this course. Are you a researcher with a software or hardware background who is going to take his or her research to the next level by accelerating algorithms with FPGAs, then welcome to this course. I'm Mohammed. I have a PhD in electronics and computer engineering. I have been teaching electronics and programming courses in several universities for more than 10 years. I have been doing research on reconfigurable computing for more than 20 years in different universities. I am the author of several conferences, journals, and transaction papers published by IEEE, IEEE, and ACM. Also, I have developed several real applications on FPGAs during my research career. In addition, I have designed some other courses on logic system design in HLS for FPJ, which are available on the Udemy platform. I'll be your instructor and guide in this course. My first goal is to simplify the new technologies in reconfigurable computing to be used by students and researchers who have no or little background knowledge of FPJ. You may have heard that FPJ design is complicated. Yes, it is if you follow the traditional HTL design flow. However, a high-level synthesis design flow makes the FPGA design easy and accessible for a large group of software and hardware engineers. It is my mission here to uncover the high-level synthesis design secrets with a straightforward and exciting approach. We are going to learn, discover, and explore the topic of function acceleration in HLS. HLS is an entirely new hardware design methodology. It is a set of hardware design flow, optimization techniques, coding styles, software tools, and debugging mechanisms. HLS is a technology that uses a high-level language such as CC++ to hide all the traditional hardware design complexities from designers. So, if you are curious about high-level synthesis and don't know where to start, welcome to this course. If you are a university or college instructor, lecturer, or professor who wants to add an HLS flavor to the traditional HTL design flow, then welcome to this course. If you want to show that you are clever enough to work with FPJ like a pro just in a couple of days, then welcome to this course. This course is based on designing Zvitas Unified Software Platform technology, including software toolsets and FPGA-based hardware platforms. The technology is well presented, and there are several examples, designs, applications, and supports around it, presented in this course and provided by Xilinx or the HLS community. The technology is already used by several companies to design many commercial devices. You can find a long list of these companies on the Xilinx website. In this course, I will use the Zinc-based embedded systems, including Zinc 7000 SoC and Zinc Ultra Scale Plus MP SoC. Throughout the course, I will use Zybo Z720 and Ultra 96 version 2 FPGA embedded system boards to implement several algorithms. The Xilinx Vitus Unified Software Platform is used to describe algorithms in C++ code and OpenSeal to map on the Zinc embedded systems. If you have a very limited or no budget to spend on FPGA boards, but still would like to learn very advanced topics on HLS and FPGA, welcome to this course. 
you can follow the emulation path if you don't have access to the actual FPGA boards. Otherwise, you only need to spend a couple of hundred pounds to purchase a zinc based FPGA board, such as Zybo Z720 or Ultra 96 version 2. And all the software tools are available for free via the Xilinx website. This course is the first of its kind that maps compute intensive tasks on FPGA using C, C++, and OpenSeal. This course is the first of a series on HLS in accelerating algorithms on a target zinc-based embedded system. Whereas this course focuses on fundamental concepts, the other courses explain different optimization techniques for describing algorithms efficiently.